Hi, my research is all about recycling rare earth elements. What are rare earth elements? These are rare earth elements. So what is so special about rare earth elements? There's a saying, oil is the blood, steel is the body, and rare earth elements are the vitamins for a social society. And so these elements are essential for producing high technology devices. For example, cell phones, computers, and fluorescent lamps. And why am I doing this research? So China has been the biggest supplier of rare earth elements over the past few decades. In 2009, China imposed uh, restrictions on exports of rare earth elements due to their increasing domestic um, consumption. Therefore, it's very important that we're recycling the rare earth elements from the end of life products. And for reasons, lamps are the most accessible resource of rare earth elements in our daily life. The white powder in the lamps is called phosphor, which contains five elements, cerium, europium, lanthanum, terbium, and yttrium. And how do I extract them from the rare earth, from the phosphors? Okay, so we use supercritical CO2. What is supercritical CO2? Every substance has three phases, solid, liquid, and gas. So, so does CO2. When CO2 is pressurized and uh, heated beyond its critical point, which is 73 atmosphere and uh, 31 degrees Celsius, then it will become a supercritical CO2, which has properties between those of a gas and a liquid. It can penetrate solids like a gas and dissolve materials like a liquid. We combine supercritical CO2 with some specific chemicals. Let it flow through phosphorus, pick up the uh, earth, rare earth elements and uh, collect them in a solution. And after we depressurize supercritical CO2, it will just become a CO2 gas and it diffuse to the air, which is really friendly to the environment. Thank you very much.